Hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome back. We're back to check out the DC trail. This is the the world needs heroes. This is like a compilation. I'm not really too sure, but let me just jump right into it and check it out. What's up, the Batman? Who are you, Batwoman? What are you hiding? Oh, Black Adam. Another world. Hmm. That's why you saved me. Hmm. The Flash. Like to say to the Yeah, Aquaman. Aquaman. What could be greater than a king? A hero. I just got goosebumps. The world. That's cool. Mm. If we don't stand up, no one will. Come with us. Whoa. Wow, that's that's pretty good. Wow, so that's gonna be so Black Adam's gonna team up with the other. Look, so I so if I can, what are they called it? Society, Justice, Justice Society, or something. Yeah. It could so it, it looks like Adam Adam Smasher. Yeah, I, uh, I don't Hawk think Man. I don't think he's gonna team up with them for us. I think. Uh, he, you know, because I think he's supposed to be come off as like a bad guy at first, because his way he had this warped sense of thinking about how things should be is different than this. So, but I think he thinks he's doing right, but he really isn't. That's why he's kind of like an anti-hero. Yeah. I think he thinks he deserves to lead or be in charge, whatever. And I think it, it comes off bad at first. Maybe I don't know. I don't really don't. I know about the, the Black Adam character, but I don't know how they're going to do this in the movie. Exactly, know exactly what the plot's going to be. You know, from what we've seen in the trails, he comes off like he's a, he's a bad guy, like, he, he, but he's really not. I don't know. Yeah, it did. It looks cool. The, the Flash movie, I think, is my top favorite one I'm looking forward to because obviously that's another time travel multiverse type movie. And also seeing Michael Keaton play Batman again for the first time in like 20 years or whatever. Yeah, you can see in that scene it was the, the Flash, you know, there's different versions of, of himself. And who was, who, was the, who was the girl? What would you say her name? Supergirl. Super, you think it's Supergirl? That's that's who it is. Oh, it is? Yeah, so I, I'm i pretty sure he's talking to Michael Keaton's Batman for sure. Because, or or it could be someone else we don't know, but I, I think that's who it is. But, um... It's going to be curious to see because, like, obviously, Ben Affleck is playing Batman, too, and it's his last time playing the character. So, I don't know how, which way they're going to go with this. Like, supposedly Michael Keaton's Batman is going to be the next Batman taking over. But, like, I think that's kind of a stupid decision because, like, first of all, Michael Keaton's, like, 60. Plus, yeah. he, even if they were to go there, like, he's not going to play it that long. Yeah, he needs, like, a younger... Which that's why I know if they, I know the Batman is supposed to be all separate all together. But they're showing this all together. It's like the, the Batman, Flash, Aquaman, and, um... What was the other one? What? The fourth character they showed. And, uh... The Flash, the Batman, the Aquaman, and Black Adam. Black Adam. So, I don't know if they... And where Black Adam also tie, is supposed to tie into Shazam... So I don't know if they're gonna tie this into to the original Justice League. They're gonna try to distance themselves from, it, but it's the same character. So I don't see how they're gonna do that. And there's still no Superman. Like, yeah. No, nobody knows when they're gonna have another Superman sequel. So I don't know. It's it's kind of confusing what the, what DC is doing or what Warner Brothers is doing with the DC universe. Either way, I think this this kind of gives me hopes. Like it, it, the trails have looked better than what I thought they were gonna be. So I'm hoping that the movies are going to be better than what I'm thinking they're going to be because it's Warner Brothers and they seem to always drop the ball and it doesn't quite live up to the hype. Other than Aquaman and Wonder Woman were good. Even though the 1984 one wasn't that good. But I don't know. We'll just have to see what happens and how everything ties together going forward. It's still kind of up in the air. So yeah, I think that's going to do it for this video. As always, we appreciate you guys tuning in. Check out our video. So hit that like and subscribe. Until next time.